Yo, what's going on, 67 Let's squad? We're doing a ranked 1v1, and it is tryhard Thursday. So we are tryharding on Thursday, obviously. If you guys have not already known, I'm doing a 24 hour stream tomorrow starting at 6 p.m. Eastern. If you're seeing this video on Thursday, it's July 28th starting at 6 p.m. Eastern. It's going to be a lot of fun. Make sure to come by. Time is an <clears throat> illusion. And, uh, and don't miss it. Don't miss it. It's going to be sick. It's your last warning because I'm not... I don't know if I'm going to upload videos tomorrow or not. I probably won't, to be honest with you, because I feel like I'll be asleep preparing for the 24-hour stream. Everything is a matter <clears throat> of but we'll see. Even time will bend we'll see. Maybe I can scrounge together one video. Um, against Zong, honestly, I kind of feel like, I mean, okay, let's be honest. I'm definitely going wing shark. I feel like I don't care about his stun that much. Is that crazy? That might be kind of crazy. How much damage does this do? About 190 plus 86 times 2. All right. All right. So I got about a 350 damage burst. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's pretty good for securing a buff if I need it. I'm thinking, do I want to try to steal his red? Because I didn't get my 2. And the reason I didn't get my 2 is because I was going to go blue buff. But now I'm thinking, what if I could steal his red? Because my burst is pretty significant. But I'm going to decide to not go for it. And I'm just going to do my blue here. Just do the blue. My damage is really good, man. That's pretty gnarly, honestly. Um... Nice. I got decent damage on him here. Decent damage on him. For sure. Missed his stun as well. Always a good thing. Always good news for me. Okay. Mr. Big Clear. My bad. Um, he does have some potions. But without a without a blue buff. You you literally never lived through this, correct? Like it doesn't even matter. Just make sure he can't blink. As long as I'm making sure he can't blink, then he dies. Might die to archers right now, actually. He did. He did, and I'm actually gonna super greed and not get my alt here. Like I said, I do have that blue buff, so I do have that that pretty significant sustain. That should help me to get his blue buff. I'm hoping. I mean, obviously... Okay. Obviously, maybe not. really don't mind waiting this out. Though I will say, I probably should try to hit level 7 because not having alt against somebody that does have an alt, obviously gigantic disadvantage. Not a great play. There we go. Now I have alt. I am safe. As long as I have enough mana for alt. Which is kind of debatable. I'm slapping these autos though. I'm doing decent. Oh, okay. He ulted for the tankiness, I assume, for the double protections. Because you get double the protections of your alt, or of your passive, I'm sorry, when you alt. I'm assuming that's why he did it. Not a great play, though, because you're kind of out in the open. Are you not? I have alt still. Oh, the wing shard to run. Well played. I'm fine. 
I'm fine. He's got no mana. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to abuse the fact that he has no mana. I'm going to back while the dude has no mana. He does have Telkine, so he clears kind of decent still. But he has absolutely no mana. There's no way he's doing his red. Um, yeah, I'm going to abuse the fact that he, he went for the wave with no mana. I'm going to back. He sure, he sure does get his blue here, but that's fine. I don't mind that. I'm going to get the red buff. I'm going to clear the wave. I would like to chuck one more out there. Nice. And we're going to use our second quadrant to sustain our mana up for us. Pretty much during every fight. At least for the, the near future. All right. That's fine. He used two abilities to get one of the three XP camps. I will take that. And using my two in that, that second quadrant basically just guarantees the fact that I'm able to very easily use both abilities for no problem. Or for no mana problems, I should say. I mean, he's just going straight attack speed. He's not going to be able to do anything about it. Right now, right now, he kind of seems like he's throwing to me. I'm going to use the first quadrant, so I'm just healing. Is I have Bancroft's healing plus my quadrant healing plus both potions. This makes me completely full HP. While he, in order to fight me, has to push up really heavily. It just makes it so I can do a lot of tower damage for free, basically. Like, I took half of his tower without any danger there. For the price of 100 gold, I took half of his tower. Because that's what the two pots cost me. Now, I'm thinking I should go uh, Shogun's instead of Genji's here, but I'm also thinking that's kind of really troll. And what I should do is just go Typhons, finish out the Life Seal, double back after Typhons, get Bancroft's Claw. That's going to give me about 20% attack speed for 600 gold. So I get 20% pen, for, and then for an extra 600 gold, I get 20% attack speed. So I think it's probably the best plan of action here. Um, he does have a lot of damage, though. He's he's doubled up on, on that attack speed. But with no defense of his own, it doesn't even matter how much attack speed you have, because I just slaughter you in a fight. It will not even be close. Yeah, I mean... Unfortunately, it's just how it works. I just know that if you have no defense and I do, you just die. You're juking left here. Thank you. That's a kill. Grab the orb. I'll use my two just for some extra damage. And I might as well disable the Phoenix for a little bit extra damage while I'm here. Grabbing the ghosts on my way out. 57 XP for each ghost is not bad, man. That's actually significant. Like that does that does have an impact on the game. Uh you still have no defense, so you still lose this fight. And it, again, it is not even close. His stun is down, so I'm in no danger of getting bursted. Oh, the blink. All right. Well played. Now he wants to one me so he can do a long stun on me. So I just need to keep my distance so he can't one. Make sure I can trade autos. All right. That's another kill. Perfect. Can't really do much with that kill. I'm too far away from his Phoenix to get the Phoenix, but him still not going defense is so greedy, dude. It's so greedy. You cannot be doing that. Slap that. Go back. All right, let's grab the Typhons. Grab the Bancroft's Claw. Again, that's going to be 10 stacks, which is 2% attack speed each stack. Simple maths. 20% attack speed. Oh, 
Now that does rely on me having a red buff, but assuming I play this at all decently, I should have a red buff like 80% of the game, 70% of the game. The only time I won't have it is between its spawner and its timer running out off me. I just saw him over there. No defense. He's going to want to stun me here. Keep my distance. Stun from afar. Don't let him stun me. Again, just keep him distance. There you go. And the surrender. GG. See you guys in game number two. Yo, what's up, boys? Game number two. I'm thinking... We could do a little Loki. I don't really ever play Loki, but uh, it's Try Hard Thursday, and I don't think I've ever played a Loki game on a Try Hard Thursday, so I figure, what the heck? Why not try it out and see what happens? We'll see what see what goes on here. Uh, obviously, we go Transcendence. Obviously, we buy some potions. Obviously, we go Horn Shard. Oh, actually, you know what? I see a lot of Lokis going uh, Carapace Shard and using it on their one. I'm actually down to give it a shot. I'm actually very down to see if maybe it does anything nice for me. Because it steals, right? Like I have 25, I have 25 physical protection. It steals 20 protections. Takes it from them, gives it to me. He probably also has 25 protections. I guess I can't see yet, but... He probably also has... Oh, there it is. Minions have spawned. I don't see him. I don't see him. Waiting for all of his abilities. Okay. Holy shit. I just tanked through everything and got red buff. Wait a second. Carapace shield might be goaded. These Loki mains might be onto something. Low-key, actual, factual, no capsule. There's no way you're this insane. Why? In what universe do you ever win that fight, sir? I don't, I don't get that one. I don't get that one at all. With Horn Shard, without Horn Shard... I mean, shit, he could even have an alt, and I think he still loses that one. But you know what? Sometimes you take what you can get. Oh, okay. I can't kill him. I'm out of mana. Oh, I really thought he'd take an extra tower shot there. All right, pretty good for me, dude. Pretty good for me. Now, here's the question. I see a lot of Lokis do this. They'll go straight into Breastplate here because more cooldown means more poke, right? I think the right play is actually a Hydra's. I could be entirely wrong about that, to be honest with you. Oh my God, get dick. Holy. <clears throat> My damage is just crazy, dude. It is simply a red buff Loki. And I have Carapace Shield back up again. To basically give me 20 flat pen. Not to mention make me tankier. I think I could win a fight. Even without alt. With him having alt. Even though we both have Transcendence. That's how fucking nuts I think I'm ahead right now. 
Oh my god, dude. Huh? I uh, like what uh, This is this is how people play Loki. I did not know the power of carapace shield. This I uh, instrument with which I conduct their downfall. Oh my god. <laughs> That's actually insane. Like this, is this dude sitting in base right now cuz I wouldn't even I wouldn't even make fun of him for it. This dude's getting manhandled. No wonder people like playing Loki so much. Holy shit. If you actually buy the right shard, it's pretty fun. <laughs> All right. He's just staying away. As he should. I'm going to go do your blue. I'm actually really surprised he just let me take that. I assumed he'd like <laughs> chuck something over the wall. Like chuck an alt over the wall or something. He's playing very, very patient. Like he, well, I mean, right when I say that, he also wave. <laughs> I guess he can't make that up, but uh, he's just kind of sitting there waiting. This might be a fiver. I think he might just surrender a five. I don't see him enjoying this very much. Both times I killed him, there was like absolutely zero counterplay. exactly okay well that was insane see you guys in game three what's up boys game number three i'm thinking marta chorus probably not chiron maybe baron Ooh. on her hmm hmm you huang tiamat searcher so maybe a scylla you got a diamond border on her a Robin game? Did I do Robin last week? Let me look. Hold on. Uh, I did play Robin last week. I'm trying to play gods that I didn't play last week either. So it's like new and fun every week. Um, But I played seven matches last week. Honestly, I'm kind of down. I'm kind of down for Scylla. Let's do it little Hachi man action. Um, I like the 11 skin a lot, but some people don't. So let's switch it up. Let's be a little, a little magical, magical terror of the deep. D Magno. That is Magnus Carlson. Or that's probably his brother. Dagnus Carlson. Darlson Magnus. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just going to buy this and this. The two points in the two, one in the one. Clear my blue and shut the hell up. That's my goal. Although I don't want him to steal my blue, so I have to play a little bit of defense here. Do I have a special? Oh, I do. I'm surfing. I'm surfing. Hello, D Magno. I'm surfing. Check me out. I'm surfing. Okay, nice. He did punch me in the head once, which was kind of not nice of him, but... That's okay. I don't need all my health. Whatever, I'm full HP anyways. We're chilling. Okay, I cleared my buff. I don't even know where he is. Oh, he cleared all of his buff at the same time. Interesting. Hello? Get out of here. 
My autos are like so thin. I really wanted to get red buff as well, but I don't know if I can, man. I don't know. Are you backing? You are certainly not backing. All right. I super out clear him, which is really good. Let's just get the minis here. Because that'll hit me five. And then I can be kind of aggro. Aegis? No Aegis? There's no Aegis? All right. I guess I have a kill and a, a red buff under my sleeve now. That's crazy. I bet you he got... He got confused from the surfing. Oh man, he hit five off the ghosts. That was actually a gamer move to pull them into your tower. I never thought about that. Pow, pow, pow. Now it's two autos. Three autos to clean that up jeepers. I don't think you ever need to go six eight, or six pots on Hachiman because and six pots, I mean three mana, three multi because his passive is MP5. So like you never need the multi pots. I really don't think I'm scared of you. And I really do think you should be scared of me. Because for whatever reason, I am... Well, I am the Terror of the Deep. Pop. Full wave clear. Level the two. Go back. Grab the Bancrofts. And literally, literally, AFK arms back. Wait for Breastplate. And breastplate two acquired. Perfect. Now we go back out. I'm what is that? About six hundred gold ahead. That's pretty wild. If you to me, then you're hot and sexy. Alright. I think I just full aggro. Like he has Griffin Wing, but I have I literally have tier two defense. Why would I ever be scared of him? Oh my god. Like, actually, Craptual, I do so much damage. Pop. We're three minutes in, so I want to look for treasure chests. Please tell me you don't do this. Oh, that was really close, actually. That was really close. I almost lost that. All right, treasure chests are back here, so I'm just gonna just gonna take that. Uh, he doesn't have alt, and I'm not scared of him. I think I just run this way. Honestly, dude. You can have the red buff. I'm okay with it. I'm so far ahead. I'm down. He doesn't seem down for it, though. He seems like he wants to fight me. But I have Bancrofts. And I have Horn Shard. Alright, well. Unfortunately, you've made the wrong decision. So I'm just going to get the red buff and run away. Um, We do the exact same amount of damage to each other. Actually, I, I do more. <sighs> hmm. I do have lifesteal compared to your no lifesteal. I'm just like not scared of him at all. Also, fun fact. He's bought Aegis and has not used it for either of my ults. I love missing everything. It's kind of my favorite pastime. Kill them. And clear. All but one. That's fine. I really want to get all the XP on the map. There we go. Put one more point in the one. 
And now I have Breastplate. Now I'm going into Mirrodin. And I have 30% cooldown. Actually, 40% with the blue buff. I should grab this chest. So I have 40% cooldown. He has Devos. I don't know where he went. Oh, he ran around. Oh, he tried to stun me. All right, let's get the Aegis. No Aegis again. Dude, you gotta Aegis. You ha you actually have to start Aegising. You can't live life this way, man. You can't just buy a relic and never use it. <laughs> Am I crazy? Did he Aegis something before? And I'm just like not paying attention to it. Scylla is a lot of fun. Hello? Alright, good dodge. Uh, his blue buff is up for grabs. So I'm going to go take it. Thank you. I don't think I want it. I think I want red buff. I think I'll greet it. I think I can kind of afford to be greedy because I'm so far ahead right now. I'm level 14 to his level 11. Hello? Get your Aegis. No Aegis again. Why am I surprised? All right, you want to stun, obviously. And now you want to ult. I missed everything. I still missed everything. That is honestly deserved. Honestly deserved. All right, perfect. Red buff acquired. We got the Mirrodin finished. We can get tier two rod. That's not how you spell rod. We don't have any pen yet. Oh, I guess we have 10%. But I, I consider like 20% when you start having pen because that's when your pen actually starts mattering. 10% is like, eh, who cares? Instead of 100, they have 90, you know? Sit like defense-wise. I could probably just do Bull Demon, but I could also actually stop Rod and just go into Poly. That might be a better decision. I suck. You're dead. You're not dead. I am dumbfounded. Dude, I'm up 2.5k. This is crazy. Treasure chest should be right here, by the way. Thank you. And thank you. And pop. Rod is 300 simple gold away. You're coming to defend your bull demon. Little do you know, I'm the bull demon. You dash away. I am okay with that. Rod is going to give me an extra 10% pen, which is when I'm going to consider myself having a little bit of pen. AKA right now. Um. Alright. <sighs> I'm okay with this. I have 20% pen, 400 power. 30% cooldown. What's another item I could go that has 10% cooldown on it? Nothing I really want, actually. I could go like Cyclopean Ring and do some weird auto attack shit. That could be kind of fun. But I think I'll probably end up just going Polly, let's be honest. Hello. I missed. I didn't miss that one. Also didn't miss that one. Nice. Massive kill. Shout out to my boy. You know who the boy is? It's Horn Shard. Let's go. Stay horny, boys. Now he does. He does have alt, and I am missing a, almost 800 HP. 
But he's got to clear wave first. So I'm thinking maybe if he clears wave first, I can get this. Oh no, this is this is tragic. Oh no, Piscadio. Now you alt. He's not alting. Wait, no, he alted before. He doesn't have alt. For some reason in my head, because I killed him before he shot his alt off, he he still had his alt cooldown up. I'm not scared of you. I do I do so much damage. My ult hit him for 776. My two hit him for 410. Our minions will spawn shortly. Root the big one in there. Clear them all out. All right. Slap this. There's some... A little bit of a Titan damage. Nothing crazy. I got a lot of gold in hand though, so I'm going to go back, grab my poly. And uh, I'm honestly not even going to go... I'm not even going to go with tier 1 item. I'm just going to buy a 500 pop because it's just going to help me end the game a little bit faster. I just got 50 more power by leveling to 19. Next level, I will gain another 50 power. Shout out to my passive. I lied. 25 power. It's 50 power with two of them. Hello? Oh, that basically hits you. Ah, uh, Zynga! Oh, man. I did a lot of damage just now. He is struggling trying to keep me back. Oh, God, dude. 600 damage like that. Oh, I missed. I'm dead. I'm not dead. I maybe should be, but I'm not. I'm going to stay aggro here. Oh, that did hit him. Now, we kill. Nice. Nice. GG, dude. GG, gamer. And I will see you guys in game number four. Because we had a five-minute surrender. So I'll see you in game number four. What's up, boys? It's the next game. And like I said, I'm trying to not do... Um, any gods that I played in the previous Try Hard Thursday... So far, we have, I believe, Kronos, Loki, Scylla in this one. So this is game number four. And I want to play... I kind of want to play AMC. Did I play him last week? I did not play AMC last week. All right. I'm down for an AMC game. Let's do it. 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 I really like this skin. I also think this skin is kind of crazy. Not because it's good, but just like when you think about like what what is he? He is he's the god of bees. You think about the god of bees and then you're like, yeah, he's a techno, he's a techno robot. He's a tech he's a techno punk robot. Sting punk. Just just absurd stuff, honestly. Just crazy stuff. He's got like a shin pad here and a thigh pad there. And then spiky toes. I don't even know what to think. He'll kick my ass. And sh and give me shin splints. And break my... my. What, what is the, what's the long bone in your left? Femur. All at the same time. I don't know. Just insane stuff. Uh, I'm just gonna... I want to... I kind of want to go transcendent soul leader combo. But last time I went Soul Leader on AMC, I felt like it was a dog shit play. So maybe I don't do that. Or maybe I do do it specifically because it was a dog shit play last time. 
and I want to make things interesting. Um, I don't know. Let's. I'm. I'm just going trans. I'm going trans. Screw it. I don't know what to do, so I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna build weird stuff. Weird stuff. You broke my hive, you psychopath. Minions have spawned. Why would you do that? Is he invading me? Or did he walk over just to break my hive for no reason at all? Where is he? What a weirdo, man. This man literally broke my hive and then blinked on me? You, you're not that guy, pal. Wait, he might be that guy. Hold up. Hold up. He might be that guy. <laughs> that was kind of close. <laughs> I'd never max my two, but I'm going to try max my two this game. Aren't you just dead? Oh, very close. Very close. You're so low, dude. You can't, you can't just do these things, man. What makes you think you can simply just walk at me? Okay. What? <laughs> he got five and insta ulted me. Just insta ulted. He didn't care about any of the consequences. My man said, fuck it, we ball. I'm backing. All right, cool. Go transcendence. I get a chalice. I still have all my hives up. He can break whatever he wants to break. It's fine. It only cost me 40 mana to blop back. No big deal. My guess is he's doing XP camp. Or not. I don't know where he is. Or what he was doing. Oh, I guess he just backed. Why? I, I I will never understand. I will never understand. Why would he do that? I'm the one with the fighting relic. Like this dude, this dude has blink. I missed. Now I'm dead. Actually, I'm not even dead. I still have shell. You're still the dead one. Dude. I know AMC's broken and all, but this guy's making some questionable plays. Some extremely questionable plays. He's just kind of running at me. Almost like he doesn't care, but I know he does, you know, if that makes any sense. Like he's running at me. Like I, one of us is dying. I don't care which one, just one of us is dying, except, you know, he wants to be the one that lives, you know, it's not one of those ones where you're like already lost the game and you're like, oh man, let's just get it over with. And you like base plant for fun. I don't know. Hello. 
I don't have any attack speed. I will say that. My build is bad. But it's also fun. I'm doing a lot of damage. Once I get my soul leader online, he is going to be hurting. He is going to be hurt. My guess is he does not let me have this red. Oh, very surprising. Okay. He actually didn't care. I do want to start stacking Soul Eater. I was just going to greed the wave, but <clears throat> there's no point. Let's just start stacking Soul Eater. Um, you're going straight into defense, so I'm going to go straight into pen. Soul Eater gives me 10 base pen. Nice, whatever. Not that big of a deal. I actually feel like Robin has a winning matchup in this in this game, by the way. I don't feel like AMC should win this. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Oh, well, that's his alt and his relic, I guess. Hello. Uh, you can't do this. You can't do this. Yep. And that is a F6 at six minutes and a GG. And I will see you guys in game number five. I'm back, boys, with the next game. I think this is game, I don't know, five or six. Um, so I kind of, I want to, let's see. I played Kronos, Loki, AMC today. Was there one in between there? Oh, and Scylla. Kronos, Loki, AMC, Scylla. I played today. So this is game five. And I don't want to repeat. Did I play Poseidon last week? I didn't play Poseidon last week. All right, let's do Poseidon game. Nice. I'm done for a Poseidon game. And I'm done to use this new skin. This, uh, what's it called? It's red something, right? Oh no, Chaotic Surge. He kind of looks like cotton candy. <laughs> but, um, I don't know. You know, if you really think about it, and I mean, like, actually really think about it, shouldn't water gods do the most damage? And it's not even close. Because, like, okay, hear me out. Water is the only substance on the on the earth i mean granted these are gods so it's not only earth that they care about but it's on, the only substance that can cut through a diamond right other than a diamond and and this water because of the high psi right the high pressure so if i have such high pressure i'm just pogging first talking now you what is this a crossover episode um i don't know He's in my guest room naked right now. I smooched him before this game. Minions. Think he believes me? That fucker. You beat the shit out of me while fucking. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually so funny. It is really funny. You doing red? I think he's doing blue. Yeah, he did his blue. Um, I mean, I just, I just guarantee this, correct? I do very easily 
Got the Griffin. Alright, that is really good for me. That is really good. That means that his Aegis is down. And I'm in the perfect position to grab a Power Spike, aka Bancroft's. <coughs> and then ult him again. And he just dies because of it. I am in the literal perfect position. I don't care about any damage I take here. All buffs on the map are gone. XP map is gone. Or XP buff is gone, I should say. Grab this and this. 30 seconds, I should get first blood. Unless I miss. In which case, we scrap the video. Um... I mean, there's nothing over here. I'm just kind of wasting time. I'm not letting him see where I am. Oh god. Ow. 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 Mm. No kill yet. I could dive though, right? Uh, I'd probably die. Even if I successfully get the whole combo off with the auto attack canceling, I'm still looking at five tower shots. I can corner him though, for sure. Perfect. Perfect. There we go, baby. There we go. Would it be a successful Try Hard Thursday video without a little Sam the Dude corner in there? Um, let's grab Breastplate here and a Chalice. Head back out for the blue buff. <clears throat> I would love to take his, but I just don't think I can. I also don't know if I could win a fight against him right now. Be honest. Your middle tower Okay. Nice. Oh my gosh, I do damage. Bro, Poseidon is actually just so good. I never get to play the S tier gods other than Try Hard Thursdays. And every single time I do it, I'm reminded like, holy shit, these gods are crazy strong. Like, you don't even have to try to get MMR capped if you just play S tier gods. It's actually crazy. He just backflip, get the Kraken. I wanted the Aegis, but whatever. Oh, that attack speed slow is gnarly on my two. Did you see that reduction? What a weird alt, man. I do not approve. You cannot be chucking weird ass alt at me like that. There's literally nothing for me to do right now. I'm just out here in the depths. Want to fight me? Alright. Yeah, you stay. It's fine. Um, I do want to just... I do want to just get some Typhon's action going. I got the treasure chest, correct? I'm pretty sure I did. I'm pretty sure he's only gotten one buff this entire game. And I've gotten, what is that, five buffs? 
I've gotten five buffs and two kills. I'm definitely feeling pretty. I am a little bit peeved that I uh, fucked up the Kraken. Honestly, I'm down to just fucking W key this. I want to get his Aegis. I'm going to I'm going to corner him again. Perfect. Perfect. Very, very good. The reason that is so good is because I have minions in tower range. Which basically just means um, he's missing out on a bunch of XP. It's just really good for me. And on top of that, do I get his blue buff too? God damn. I do. I do get his blue buff as well. Do I get red buff as well? God damn. I just get all the buffs. Am I just buffing? I just buff his shit out of here. Hello. Dude. I am using a lot of mana. Don't get me wrong. But I'm confirming absolutely every little bit of XP on this map right now. It has got to be exhausting being him at the moment. He did get the XP camp. But so far, he's only gotten one buff out of nine. Hello. What if I just halt? Because you don't have Aegis. And I do a shit ton of damage. Yeah. Ex exactly. I do actually so much damage. And you have no way to stop me. He is getting some defense online now, but it seems a little bit too late. Doesn't it? Oh, hello. Damn, dude. I do so much damage, it's hard to imagine that he wins this fight really ever i mean he probably won't win the fight but he might be able to to sneak the kill the bull demon kill i mean never mind i did that in 0.4 seconds let's get some attack speed now uh, i'm down for berserkers plus talon talon gives me 14 percent attack speed berserkers is going to give me some defense and a little bit more attack speed um, but yeah, I mean, overall I'm 2.1 K up. It's just kind of, it's kind of nasty. He's waiting for me. I want your blue buff. You need a backflip. Yo, what? He pressed two buttons before I could press one button. You cannot just keep alting like that. It's never going to work the way you want it to. Bro, I'm doing too much. I'm doing the absolute most right now. I don't even think he can kill me here, realistically. Yeah, 
He can't. He just loses here. <clears throat> All right. Fine. We'll call it a draw. <laughs> GG gamer. <laughs> that's really funny. GG. Well played. Uh, that's probably the last game of the video. Cause I've been recording for an hour and a half and I assume, you know, I didn't take any breaks. So I assume cutting out the timers is going to be about 30 minutes. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. I really appreciate it. We ended up getting five games in here, maybe six. And, um, we're 10 MMR away from MMR capped, which is kind of funny. But yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching the trial Thursday. Don't forget tomorrow, 6 PM Eastern. Friday, July 28th, 6 p.m. Eastern, 24-hour stream. We've got a lot of opportunities to win a lot of money. So come by twitch.tv says Sam the Dude. It's this little one right here, the little purple icon. Um, it's twitch.tv slash Sam the Dude. Just type that in. Easy peasy. You're gaming. All right. Peace out, boys.